light is a, Come on, bro. Light is a light is a character. Oh my god. He is an absolute character. All right. I so the Diddy Kong is coming out. Uh I'm not sure what we were waiting so long for, but Alright, yeah, right so tunes, Samus versus Diddy Kong. Alright. So Dakpo going with the Diddy. That only seemed character, at least at the higher levels of Smash Ultimate. Yeah. Um but still I mean this banana is still one of the best tools in the game as far as I'm concerned. Like, yeah, I mean Diddy definitely lost oh okay. Okay, I was about to say, he didn't lose some of the cool stuff that he was able to do before, or some of the easier stuff. Down it doesn't work nearly as, as well as it did in uh, in 4. Yep. But I still think that Diddy has a pretty solid frame data, and that, that banana is just really nice. I think one of Diddy's biggest problems is uh, like that forward air, rising air, or well, the forward air pressure that we used to get back in the game just doesn't work uh, like it does in Ultimate. It doesn't have the same, like, just not the same delivery. Yeah. You know? But kudos to him. He's using these bananas to perfection. Oh, that was really solid. Just kind of dash back and forth. Lucky for Slap, man. Uh, it's a very hairy character that Samus is in all this armor. Got a little weight on him. Looking for the air dodge behind, but ends just taking a big back air. Hold on now. Slap, working with a little, uh, working with a little steam. Got to oh, uh, Slap. Yeah. <laughs> Got to put the sleep on that one. All right, that close. Very solid lead. Let's see how far he can really take this. I don't see too much Diddy representation anymore. But when you do, they tend to be full of a lot of tricks. Right there. Oh, that was real. Ooh. Wow. Talk about, look at all that damage he got on one parry to up tilt and just followed it up so cleanly. I didn't know you could actually get that up there after that, though. That was yeah, that was, that was surprising, surprising to me as well. Hey, okay, Slep, right now, just. I, I think he's keeping the smaller charge shots because when you get like the half charge, you actually. Uh, yeah, they, they're stunned a little longer. Uh, so you can get uh, like a, a follow up. So usually you'll see that into possible dash attack or grab or things like that. But I think at this point in time, he might want to just bet on getting a full charge and uh, piece of more, or at least a, a bigger charge. Yeah. And just trying to finish the, uh, the stock like that. This is yeah, definitely getting out of hand for him, uh, for him to be able to mount a comeback. Oh, all right, big whiff. How does he get back to stage? Actually gets on with the forward air. All right. Bales are, bail. are homing. He wanted oh! to bail shenanigans. Actually, wasn't it this tournament where the, the moniker Barrel Technician was born? Didn't you give that to MVD at this tournament? Back and forth? Like, you this sure venue, this venue, this venue. Sure was, Paragon. Was that before CEO? I'm not sure. It was CEO or this. But okay. Yeah. I just remember, like, in this venue, uh, Barrel Technician was running rampant. Oh, yeah. I feel, like, I feel like we're just seeing some attempts again. Oh, my goodness. Just whipping them forward with that fourth throw. Yeah, I had to get out of there, but. Even so, I mean, Art, whoa. Doesn't, uh, doesn't able to grab the ledge for some reason with that uh, that there. I feel like he was actually pretty close. Kicks through that rocket. Strongest split you ever seen. And, yeah, this is just, I don't even know what, what Slep can really do to get back into this game right now. I mean, like, where is he going to find that early stock? I mean, starting right there, nice, a nice shot. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Oh. That's not, that's not going to help him at all. At all. I, like the, I like the idea, though. That's a very good get out of jail free card uh, for, or, you know, get off me button for Samus players. Still think he might want to believe a little more into this charge shot, uh, being a little higher up and going for the, the raw power instead of the combo. I think he can probably still get, like, the small charge shot into that <laughs> What is a man zooming right He's now? He's just making his own decisions right now. I also like the fact that Slep usually isn't going for the full charge shot, so uh, big difference in the full charge shot. I mean, obviously, it's just a little more power, but it, gives, it puts you in lag. Like, if she doesn't shoot a full charge shot, she doesn't get as much uh, lag as when she shoots, like, a regular charge shot. He's going to get that S-Smash somehow. He's going to find it somewhere. He said, where there's a will, there's a way. Yeah. Wins. All right. Uh, good Diddy action. All right, so we're gonna keep the Samus going. Obviously, I don't think I don't actually think Slim might actually also play Lucina too, or he's at least played uh, against me online. But again, you know, we're in tournament. We're gonna bet on what definitely works, and it seems like what definitely works for him this time around is, or to get him this far, what's the Samus? Yeah, almost, almost getting dumped right at the beginning. 
Would have been a terrible start right there for Slim. Okay. Another one. Ooh. Okay. Oh, he took. Oh, it had the banana in his hand. Okay. He scooped it up. Yeah, snatched it away for real, for real. Okay. Solid monkey flip. Really good for positioning. I like how he always has this banana ready, man. You gotta play Diddy Kong. You gotta have that banana at the ready every single time. I almost caught that. I thought, I thought Slip was actually gonna try to roll on for a second. Scoops him out of that uh, monkey flip, though. Benefit. Oh, oh watch out, though. It's homing. Don't don't sleep. That joint coming back. It do. No. <laughs> they know where you be. <laughs> oh, the double strike. Ah, man. Okay, run up. Uh, dude, this is like really bad for Samus. I feel like Samus has like, one of the worst trip animations in the game. Like, it just, it's so long. She, right. uh, she just be stumbling. Like. <laughs> Playing like the down smash, really smart to cover both options. He might have tried to select. Yeah, that's what's doing yeah. now. Yes, sir. And every single time, it's just it's just easy go to for that move. So. Yeah, tries to get the grab there They're off the mark. And see, that's you saw, you saw how much lag he was in uh, after the full charge yep. shot. So, you know, mm -hmm. full charge shot. Yeah, power's there, but lag. It's it's, it's the trade off. So, if you know you're gonna hit it, then dope. You know. Sometimes, also it pushes you pretty far back, so you do it off stage and ends up sometimes killing, uh, killing Samus players. All right, up throw. Actual man, just running all over Slep right now in the second game. This is tough, man. Like straight up, I feel like Slep really has any kind of answer. It's probably good that in the first game, like he started to kind of get a semblance of what to do, but yeah, yeah this second game has just been an absolute. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, nice match. Yeah, I gotta say, it, you can see it. Yeah, bro. Like. <laughs> Yeah, I'm on, we're only speaking facts here, man. Okay, I, I, would, I would definitely love for Slep to you know, be able to bring this one back to a very respectable game, but it's not looking so respectable right now. Already lapped the percentage, still trying to find a way to get this first stock off. Pretty much forced at the edges at all times. Ne never really in stage control. This is, here we go, new player. It's going right. to be enough, though. All right. 120, though, man. I mean, that is a lot to deal with. And he's been getting caught frequently with that banana to forward smash that Doc Pro has not shot away from going for every single time to close up these stocks. No. And that time, just leaving yourself wide open, easy down smash, all about accumulating damage at this point. I think, I think I know Smash might have been able to finish there. Oh, right? wow. That's going to do what that a catch. Was, that was really good. What a catch. That reminds me how Falcon will try and kind of trap you with his command grab as well. Right. Really solid. Diddy Kong can obviously do it too. Get the results he's looking for. So one stock to go for Doc Po. I like the fact, I mean, like, he's also just respect, he's respecting projectiles enough to not just be running through. Like, you have to jump over him, quick parry this time around, uh, forcing Slept to, to approach him. Seeing that Slept, you know, is not in the lead, he's going to have to approach anyway. Okay, double neutral air action. Damn, okay, dancing on him right now. Mm. Oh, nice. Down throw. Immediate banana pickup. Yeah. Like, I'm, not even, I'm not even going for the follow up, bro. I have no other options. Yeah. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I built my legacy on. Goodbye. That on actually might do it. Yeah, well, on the platform, yeah. he had to go. That was tough. Yeah, trapped, traps on traps on traps, basically, right there from uh, Jackpo. All right. We bro. out here. We out here, man. No doubt about it, man. Trap City, man. Trap God. Yeah. So, good stuff. Got I mean, and, and, and it was just, it's just crazy how, like, transparent his game plan was, mm -hmm. but at the same time, he's really effective with it. Yeah. He's really effective with it. Like, Banana's going to be my confirm into everything. That's what he did. That's it. That's simple. Love it, though. As I said, I, I'm pretty sure if, if Slep was able to make that upset, that would have been an upset. So, but uh, Dakpo, definitely don't. You can't sleep on him. So, my man is, uh, nah. he might not be in a lot of top eights, but he's definitely in a lot of top 16s, top 32s. You know, gets out of pools very frequently. Can't, can't put my man down. Can't put my nah, man down. not at all. Here we go. I, th I think Slep actually has to come commentate next, so that's rough. But, but like, yo, Slep, are you commentating next? Yeah. Oh, that's all right. That's rough, bro. That's rough. It's like, all right, bro. That's well, a grinder, though. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's a grinder. grinder. We respect that. That's a grinder. So I told you the barrels are heat seeking, man. I don't. The, I think these barrels. Uh, some barrels came down a little later too. Yeah. Uh, they just didn't come back and hit him. But I heard. I, I heard that like, or I felt that like the explosion. You know, what I'm saying on the other side of the stage. I love how like, I squeezed right. that nair in there. Yeah. And it was like a small window, but he was like, you know what? Cause he's, think, he's probably thinking he's gonna pick a defensive option. Slip's like, nah, I'm just gonna put out a hitbox and knock you back. All right, we got the super slow technology, and that oh, was yeah. a terrific catch. 
I mean, again, it really reminds me how Falcons like to kind of punish people in that aspect, and Diddy Kong can do it too. Yeah. Very similar command grab style. And this whole setup right here, yeah, 90%. Going to be 111 after the hit. That's all she wrote. Damn, Dak probably, he took his, he took his headset off well before that uh, F smash finished. Like, he, he knew. Yeah. He was like, I got to go, bro. So, <laughs> Speaking of which. Yeah, so speaking of which, I mean, we all got to go. So, <laughs> guys, uh, thank you guys for, you know, being here, watching the main stage. We'll be back a little later yes. for some more uh, Black Play commentary. But as of now, we're going to go ahead and take a quick commercial break. Right, right. Yep. Take a quick commercial break, guys. We'll be right back with main stage action right here. Keep it locked. See you soon.